back my peeps today we're gonna make another cookie <clears throat> it's probably gonna be the last cookie um you know time is is boiling down to the holidays and uh i just want to make one more cookie we're gonna make this cute little santa cookie so easy to make let's go on ahead and get to it so i took a pencil and kind of outlined where i want the hat part to be and where i want the face part to be so uh, I'll show you how I did it. So I took um, anything with a straight edge. You know, you got to turn the cookie upside down. Anything with a straight edge. And you just draw a line with a pencil where you think you want the hat to end. And I think I want it to end. I probably could have went a little bit lower, but, you know, you draw that. And then what I did is I took it. And I, you know, by hand, I just, like, made a circle for the face. A semi-circle for the face. Okay? And then, I kind of cheated because I painted these faces on here. Because there's no way I was going to try to put, <laughs> like, spackle and stuff on there. So, for this face, I used Cameo Pink. And then for this one, I used Classic Caramel. So you just go on in there and paint it. Let's paint one. Um, where my brush at? Hold on. You know what? Sometimes I think I'm going crazy. The brush was right there, but you know. So I just take the inside of my cap and use the paint that's in there. And I'll just go around and carefully paint. You don't have to be 100% perfect, but you know, you want it to look neat and nice. So just take your time. I only put one coat, one. That's enough. It don't need any more than that. See, so now you got the face part. Then, for the cap, I um got a little bit of red spackle. And I just took some on my, you know, on my, I could probably use a little bit of water in here. Hold on, let me... If your spackle is, gets a little dry, just add some. I like using the spray bottles. That way I won't over, like, spill water in there. Because, you know, if you go by the sink or something, you might end up putting in too much water. And then it's going to get really to the point where you can't use it. And we don't want that. So this is good. I need to take some of it off. Because you don't need that much. Just need a little bit. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna just like try to get it into that. Just spread it along. You don't have to get it exactly to that line because we're gonna put this edge right here. So you just wanna cover enough of the hat. See that? You don't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be like 100%. You just want to make sure the parts that are going to be seen um, look a little decent, you know? And that's good. You don't have to, like I said, you don't have to take it down to the edge because you're going to put some white spackle over that part. So you'll be all right. Just make sure you get the parts that are going to be seen, okay? And then you're good. Right? So let me put this away. Well, let's make another one. Let's make this one. <clears throat> Just smear it onto the onto the red part, you know, the part you want the hat to be. Just try to get a good coat. 
Sometimes it's hard to work with this spackle because it got a mind of its own. But for the most part, it lays down. And there you go. Wait, I need a little. And we good. See that? Don't have to be 100% perfect. So don't get yourself all crazy trying to get it down perfectly because it's really not. It's really hard. So before I put the white the white spackle on it. I'm going to put the face on. So what I did for the face. I just used. <coughs> for the pink face. I put blue eyes. With a dotting tool. And for the brown face. I used. This is a dotting tool. Just has a round. You can use the back of a, of a paintbrush. If you want. You can use um, anything that has like a round point. So all I did was put one eye, two eyes. See that? Can't get simpler than that. <clears throat> and then for the pink face, I did blue eyes. Did it the same way. Just put my my. Oh, I got a lot of paint on this one though. <laughs> Wait a minute. I don't want to mess it up. Let me get a wet wipe. You don't want to have too much paint on there. You just kind of want to dab it. Let's see. Hope I don't mess it up. One the oh, Okay, that was good. And. Two eyes. You see that? Pretty simple. And for the nose, I used um, some puffy paint. Yep, that's what I used. So I got some puffy paint here. For the pink face, I used just a dot of pink. Now let's make sure this thing don't squirt on us. Hold on, because I'm trying to do everything with one hand. So I just put one dot for the nose right and then I use my brown puffy paint squirt out a little bit okay and made a little nose for that you see that that's it that's the face we're not gonna get too complicated it's not a lot of space to work with so we're just going to let that be it, okay? So I took some white spackle. And um, <clears throat> put it in a you know, pastry bag. I'm using tip number 18. Wilton tip number 18. And so what I did, let me put a little bit out. Yep, that's good. So basically, I just went across it. And just piped. I'm gonna put the a dot here for his hat, and then I'm gonna put this down. But let's do this one while we let's just get them over with together. Boom, 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 boom. Nothing really hard about that. Put a dot at the top. So then I'm gonna put them down, and basically what you're gonna do. It's the same thing you did with the hat. You're just going to do it. You're going to go around his face. And do the same thing. And then you're just going to fill in the rest of the heart. And that's it. Let me put one in the middle. Because I always forget to put one in the middle. Alright, let me put this down so you can see what I'm doing, because you see that? And that's it. They're pretty simple to make. Just cut you off some heart cookies with some salt dough. <clears throat> and we're going to go around this face the same way. And we're just going to fill it in.
and this one got a little bit um hold on let me see because when i was putting the face the ugh, i messed up his nose eh. ugh. it's always something i forgot about his nose let me put on another nose kind of messed it up a little bit but <clears throat> it wasn't my fault the cork squirted the, not the cork the spackle after it dries a little bit you could go tap down some of the edges you don't like the way it looks and they go about other cookie so those are pretty easy to make you can make a bunch of those um should we do this one just to kill some time. All right, let's make the face again. Hold on, where's my blue paint? What did I do with the blue paint? See, sometimes, I'm like right here, I didn't move from nowhere, or oh, it's hiding behind this thing over here. <laughs> I'm like, I didn't go anywhere. All right, let's do this face real quick. One eye, two eye, okay. Got that. Right? <clears throat> Put on a hat. These cookies are so cute and they're so easy to make. I think it's one of the easier cookies. Smear it on there. That's all you're doing. Smearing. Get a good smear. And it kind of makes it look like a real cookie. You know how when you put on frosting on your cookie? All right. That's good. And you're just gonna get your cork again. We're gonna put his nose on last since I already messed up the other nose. We'll just put that one on last. And again, just go boom, boom. Put a a, a, a dot at the top. Put it down and just come and just go around the face first. And then you just fill in the rest. Very easy. And you got your Santa cookie. And let's put the little nose on. We good to go. So guys. Santa cookies. Very easy to make. Just cut you out a heart-shaped cookie with some um, salt dough. Make some salt dough. I have a salt dough recipe. Very easy. If you follow it, you shall have no problems with your salt dough. And uh, it'll come out looking really good. And you can make you some pretty old cookies like these so guys i'm gonna let you go i just wanted to make a quick easy santa cookie with you guys so you can add it to your well i didn't even bring the tray add it to your um your cookies for santa plate let me get it hold on a second So these are the cookies we've made. Hold on, let me move these out the way because they're still soft. So look, we have our cookies for Santa tray. We made Christmas cookie trees. We did gingerbread. I just added the peppermint bark just because we made, let's put the Santa cookies over here just for a little contrast. 
We made wreath cookies, another Santa cookie, another wreath cookie. Here we go. Our cookies for Santa tray. Plate. I mean Santa tray. Love it. We did a good job. Oh, I forgot to add my cookie tower. Let's see where I'm going to put that. Now I got to organize. Because this one is kind of tall. So, anyways, I'll fix it up and take a good picture of it. But this this is our cookies, guy, guys. Uh, so, until the next video, you guys stay safe, healthy, and keep on crafting. Don't give up. If you're a newbie, just keep trying. I didn't know how to make this when I first started. Um, you keep on trying, and you just go for it, okay? So I'll talk to you later. God bless. Bye.